Hey guys, about two years ago I made a skate video and many people asked for a tutorial, so here we go. I'll show you 15 things you can do everywhere, every time you skate, and they will hopefully make you a better skater. That's how I learn skating, so you might learn skating that way too. Um, of course, everything is on your own risk, so yeah. Let's start with something simple, sprinting. It might sound stupid or strange, but it can help you improve your balance and yeah, it will probably make you a tiny bit better skater, so try it. It's not too easy, when you go really fast on your skates, you need to have a good balance and of course, it will keep you fit because it's quite exhausting. Great, next thing is stepping over while you drive curves. So, that way you can accelerate while you're doing a curve and it will help you do many other tricks and it will help you to get a nice flow so you can chain up different tricks like turns and spins. Great! Next thing we want to do is to go in line. So we want to put our feet into one line, either with the left foot in front or with the right foot in front. Um, at the beginning it's not too easy to get your skates into one line right behind each other. But when you get it done, it feels great to do curves. Just keep practicing this. Okay, next up, go on just one leg. This will greatly improve your balance, and balance is important for everything. Especially in hairy situations where you are about to fall, so keep on practicing this. Well, here we go, number five, obstacles. There are always things coming in your way, making your skater's life harder, like gravel, grass, curb, rails, bad roads, manhole covers, and so on. Instead of avoiding those annoying things, just take them as they come. It will improve your balance and prepare you for situations where you accidentally hit an obstacle. But this might hurt your skates and strain your wheels and bearings. So this is a little disclaimer. If you can't stand that, don't do it. Okay, next thing are turns. That's not too easy at the beginning, but keep on practicing. Start really slow, lift up one foot, turn it outwards, put it back down and you will turn around. As I said, that takes a lot of practice and patience, but it's worth it. Everything is about to become one with your skates. So the next thing might sound a bit strange, but try to walk steps. When you don't hold on to something, it will greatly improve your balance. And sometimes it's quite handy. By the way, try to go upstairs. That's a lot safer in case you fall. Now something everybody wants. Going backwards. Start on a flat surface and go really slow. Take your time and get used to it. When you put your skates in one line, it will get you a safer stand. This is something you need to practice a lot. Now you can go backwards, or at least you're practicing. Try to get into backwards directly out of a turn. So go forward, turn halfway round, and keep going backwards. That's a lot of fun once you can do it. Start slowly and increase your speed when you get used to it. Okay, next up, don't break. Well, that might sound strange or stupid, but just 
try not to break. There are so many different ways you can avoid breaking by doing curves, by doing turns, by... Just check the video out. It's a fun challenge and keeps your wheels in a good state. Of course, this only makes sense when you go downhill. You can go backwards and you can do turns now, so try to jump into turns. It's quite easy as you only have to do a rotation of 180 degrees. When you turn your upper body before you jump, half of your body already did the rotation. That makes it really easy to do the turn as only your feet have to do the rotation. When you get more confident, try to jump turns over things, from the curb or even from some steps. Great, let's try something fun. Let's only use two wheels. So you can use your two front wheels, your two back wheels, or one of your front wheels and one of your back wheels. The easiest way to go is to use one of your front wheels and one of your back wheels. You can go forward, make turns, and go backwards. Number 13 is something I find quite difficult, is going backwards on one leg. Well, next up are jumps. Just jump over everything you see. First, jump over things where it doesn't matter if you don't make it like road markings. Then you can try different obstacles and you can even try jumping with just one leg. But hey, be careful. Okay, last thing on the list are spins. I'm still not a pro in this discipline, so I'm still practicing, but it's pretty cool when you can do it. There's a lot more you can do on skates, but these were my 50 things you should practice. Tell me about your experiences in the comments. Okay, that's it for today. Go outside, put on your skates, keep on practicing and have fun.